In Upper Arlington, there was a heated school board discussion tonight over masks. Last week, the district announced it would strongly recommend masks for all students, but no requirements were put in place. So tonight, parents on both sides of the debate showed up ready to protest. 10 TV's Richard Solomon takes you inside the meeting to reveal the final decision. The debate on masking continued deep into the night in Upper Arlington. Parents urging school board leaders to make a decision. Nothing you say is going to change my mind. My child will breathe, my child will come mask free. It was a dividing line as there were just as many people unmasked as there were wearing masks. These moms created a display of more than 800 masks representing the amount of people who signed a petition in favor of a mandate. Wearing a mask protects everybody. It's something that's not necessarily always convenient. The medical advisory team recommended that a mandate needed to be in place as the Delta variant spreads. But the school board approved an amended motion that will require masks to be worn for students K through 8. Masks are strongly recommended for high schoolers. Board members say they've received hundreds of emails and letters from parents and have taken every single one into consideration with their decision. The, our goal is to maximize instructional time by preventing the Delta variant disease spread. The board says that looks like kids in school five days a week. They did make note that high schoolers have a high vaccination rate and they'll keep a close eye on data from all school levels. But I do think we need to make um, decisions that are the best for all of our collective students. Reporting in Upper Arlington, Richard Solomon, 10TV News.